Are your need 2025 students? Yes, the counseling rounds are going to start. You are probably also wondering whether I'll get a seat this time or not. You don't want to take a drop because, you know, this year need was crazily, unexpectedly difficult. Last year it was very easy, but the competition was high. You don't want to take a chance. So, my advice is if you are getting a seat, maybe a private college at a decent fees or you are getting an option abroad please take it rather than just going for a drop because you already might have heard or have experienced it that taking a drop is definitely not an easy task so it's not that i have come here to demotivate you from taking a drop but i'm giving you some practical solutions because i was just talking you know uh, or over call and even chats with many students and I have I even have some chats with some students who have taken drop for four years, five years also. And they are like, sir, we are done. This year's need just devastated us. We don't want to take a drop. We just want a college. Can you help us? Some students are like, we are ready to pay the fees also. I don't care whether it is private or government. Now, I'll tell you one interesting thing. See, rather than taking a private college by paying very high fees, Find a private college which is affordable in your category, in your quota, in your home state, number one. Number two, if you can't find that, there is a manner in which if you fill the counseling form because the counseling process of NEET is a zigzag, zigzag process. Stage one, stage two, you have to drop out, fill in the form again, again, reevaluate home state quota, this quota, that quota. So many things are there and if you miss one step or if you are not aware of certain things, even when you are eligible, you will not get it. Many students didn't know that at such low scores also, I could have got this private college because more than 1 lakh seats are there. But it's not that exactly 1 lakh students will enter into the college or 1 lakh ranked students will enter. Many students out of them will take a drop. Some students will go abroad. Some students will make a mistake. So the cutoff is not exactly 1 lakh rank. It goes much beyond that, remember. So don't lose hope. And when you plan to do MBBS abroad, the best thing is fees are low. You save a lot of money, at least a crore rupees you can save. And both a student doing India MBBS or abroad MBBS, they both have to give the next exam to practice in India. Just like NEET, you have the next exam. Okay. Only then you are eligible to practice in India. And after that, you have to give the NEET PG exam. So if the exams are same, whether you study here or there, how does it matter? India or abroad? Fees you can save. Many students think, sir, I have a lot of money. I can use it for MBBS. Please understand, not many people will tell you this. You need that money for PG also. PG seat is very, very difficult. And there also you will need crore. Many parents don't plan financially for PG. And then you have to suffer. Because then again you have to take loan or you have to again take a drop. So better to save your money in MBBS. Use it for PG. And when you save that money, it can grow also. You never know. So my advice is, if possible, you are getting a seat. You have to take the chance and go to the college. But not many people know how to fill the counseling, which colleges are there and which colleges are there abroad, which countries are safe. Right now, the wars are going on. So you cannot randomly go to any country. You need a safe passage. You have to complete five years. You need so many documents. When document is not filled or not complete, you can be deported or not allowed only in the country. And how to get in there, a proper counseling session, not by me, but by experts, guys who are deeply involved in sending even low and medium scorers to the top colleges. You will be shocked to know that many low scorers get into MBBS and normal average scorers are like, how did you get MBBS seat? How? I scored more than you and still I did not get because you did not fill the form properly. You did not apply to proper colleges. Many students do MBBS abroad. And then they come and tell back to their friends, my MBBS is done. And still some students are taking a drop after 4-5 years. So guys, don't do this mistake. So that's the reason why we have come up with the counseling for all of you. It's a personal counseling 
वन इज टू वन काउंसलिंग या या वन इज टू वन काउंसलिंग ऑसम राहुल नाइस टू सी यू इन द डीएनए टू पॉइंट बैच लीजा I'm so glad you are planning to do MBBS abroad. This is a perfect thing for you. Two things. First, in Bangalore, we are doing a proper counselling where all of us are going to be there this Sunday, June twenty second, eleven thirty to one o'clock, with the experts to navigate your post need journey. Even if you are wondering whether I should take a drop, still you can come. Not an issue. Okay, if you are confused, if you want to take MBBS seat abroad, please come. If you want to take a MBBS seat in India. please come we are going to guide you counsel you with a personal personal guide but sir i am not in bangalore what to do well we are starting the counseling everywhere guys not just in bangalore in fact walk into the nearest vedantu learning center or even you can register online for this 4 o'clock to 8 o'clock with limited slots with a proper mentor who is an expert in sending low scorers to good colleges okay 11 june onwards we have already started the counseling the form links are there in the description box so as you are as you are watching this particular video please register for the event in bangalore because seats are limited last time you would have seen we just did it in a classroom we closed the entries the entire class was full we don't take more students okay so the bangalore event 22nd june please spread the word okay to your friends 11:30 to 1 o'clock okay fill your names and contact numbers this is for bangalore okay this sunday 11:30 onwards for mbbs in india or abroad sir i want to do counseling well don't worry the form link is here we will get in touch with you please fill this form check out this link whether you want to do mbbs abroad or in india whatever path you want to take or even want to take a drop you need counseling for that because it is not easy guys even i have gone through the things when i wrote my j examination so enter your phone number and our expert team for allied medicine mbbs in india mbbs abroad career opportunities nursing other things whatever career path you want to choose we will help you not just mbbs everything allied medicine and nursing also okay so the link is there in the description box please fill it up and uh, you know one is to one mentorship with faculties offline the link is also there over here okay so if you want to get personalized career counseling with a offline way not uh, online this is also there so that option link is there below every day 4 o'clock to 8 uh, o'clock in the evening 11 june onwards we are taking in those entries at our vedantu offline center spread across the country so you can go offline or online but the bangalore event is definitely offline okay i hope this is absolutely clear so don't take any risk just be informed see don't make a decision but at least be informed uh, go to hundreds of counseling no problem no problem okay do 10 counselings but at least know what are the options maybe from this place you will get to know two things that place you will get to know five things you make the decision later on okay guys so captain shreyas sir is always there for you please like this video and share this video with all your friends batchmates colleagues juniors seniors whosoever okay if you are a family member or maybe a parent please share it with your colleagues in whatsapp groups very important thank you so much captain shreyas from your vedantu neat english channel signing off thank you for liking